In this video, I'm going to show you how to connect your Xbox controller to your PC two ways. Now, the first way involves using a USB-C cable, and all you need to do is plug it into the top of your controller, which will cause the front light to turn on, as well as it'll vibrate, indicating that it's connected. Now, the great thing about using a wired connection is not only are you less likely to get input lag, but you also don't need any batteries. Now, the second method will involve using Bluetooth, so you are going to need batteries for this. So go ahead and put in a fresh pair of batteries. And once you've done that, what we're going to do is put on the back cover. Then we're going to be going to our computer and go to the search tab and we're going to type in blue. Then we're going to select Bluetooth and other devices settings and you want to ensure Bluetooth is turned on. And then we're going to select add a device. Then we're gonna be selecting Bluetooth, and then this is going to put your computer into pairing mode. So I want you to grab your Xbox controller and you wanna press and hold the sync button at the top, which is also going to put your controller into pairing mode. So we're gonna give this a second. You'll also notice the button on the front is flashing as well, indicating it's in pairing mode. And then you should see in a couple of moments, Xbox wireless controller pop up. So we're gonna go ahead and select this. And if you do get an error the first time you click on it, don't worry, just click on it again and most times it'll work. Now we're in a game and as you can see the Xbox controller is working beautifully. So if you're experiencing any problems with connecting your Xbox controller, click on the screen right now or the video pinned in the top comment.